what is going on guys welcome i hope all is well i made it to my camp spot i am camped within the trees a lot of trees this time so i'm gonna get camp situated and have a good time So camp is all set up and squared away for the most part. Uh, I still have to work on the firing. So there is an old firing if you want to take a look right here. I am going to relocate it to further down here, kind of pretty much where my camp is. I'm going to put it about right here. I'll move the wood, but yeah, the firing will be right here so I can enjoy my fire. And then I'm cooking on the fire tonight, I'm making chicken wings, so that's gonna be delicious. But for right now, I'm actually just gonna chill, relax, and enjoy the peace and quiet. I have been nothing but chilling and relaxing. It's been great. But now I am actually going to take care of the firing, get that situated and taken care of so I don't gotta worry about that. So I can have an awesome fire tonight. And uh, I did a little walk around and I saw some trash, some random stuff that I'm gonna go ahead and pick up and clean up. Uh, so that's taken care of. And just keep enjoying my time here out in nature.
All right, well, I got the camp firing all situated. I just got to add the wood in there, but I ended up going and scavenging some wood. So I went and uh, got that stuff. So including my stuff, I will have an awesome fire tonight and in the morning. But so I am in a larger like campsite. And so there was this wood that was right here and then the wood that I got right here. You can see that there's a big old firing right here. Whew, that was a workout, man. All right, I am going to do my walk around and pick up the trash that I saw, clear that up. So check it out, I'm just picking up trash and on the road there's those road graders. Cool. You know, I was, uh, as I was walking around, I was seeing these blue markings. I wonder if that's the forest service, like, determining what trees are going to end up cutting down. So I decided to get the fire going so I could get the wood dwindled down and some coals going so in a little bit I can start cooking. It is, so it got up to 83 degrees outside. In the shade it was perfect, but when you're out in the sun it was a little hot. Now it's 71. It's nothing but beautiful, man. Nothing but beautiful. All right, I'm gonna enjoy the fire. It's freaking going crazy, take a look. So I'm gonna enjoy, enjoy the fire, let that dwindle down, periodically add some logs, and then I'm gonna make some tea.
All right, so before I cook my chicken wings, I actually, I have some potatoes and some zucchini that I already cut up and um, I'm gonna put on the grill. So I just put olive oil, what is it? Paprika, seasoning, salt, and pepper. <clears throat> all right, I got my food all finished. Take a look. There it all is. I already have been eating. I was eating away. So I'm just gonna eat away, add some more wood to the fire, and enjoy my evening. It is pitch black now. So I will see you guys at some point tomorrow morning.
Good morning, everybody. I've just been enjoying my morning. This has been a great trip, just relaxing, chilling, enjoying my time. Uh, I've been enjoying the fire. I'm gonna add a little more wood. That big old log, that's what it looks like right now. I'm gonna add a little more wood so it can keep burning. I really don't need it. What, what's the temperature? Let's see. It's beautiful right now. It's like perfect weather. It's 63 degrees. Oh, it's beautiful. I took a little walk around. I saw a little more trash, picked it up. I did notice, um, so yesterday, I'll show you real quick. So this, I noticed this yesterday, so I dragged it over to the tent because I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna haul it when I leave. And then on my walk today, I noticed this one, so I grabbed it. I hope there's no other ones. It, it, it was off like in the distance over there. But anyways, I'm getting hungry, so I am going to make my breakfast. First, I'm gonna add some more wood to the fire.
My breakfast was awesome, guys. I took the sweatshirt off because it was getting hot, especially next to that fire. The fire's pretty much out. Um, but I decided to do another walk around a little bit further away from camp, not too far. But since I found that second foam thing further away from camp, I'm like, let me just take a little walk around a little bit further and see what other trash there is. Oh look, there's a plastic thing right here. All right, let's see uh, if we find anything. beautiful out here uh, I see something over there all right we'll work our way that way You can tell that there's some uh, poop areas out here. You can see where people covered it up. Kind of sad that, just dig a, dig a hole. It's not that bad and you're good. Anything over this way, so where'd I see? Oh, over here. Oh, look at that. I don't know if I should be upset about this or not, but that's from uh, corn, the outer corn stuff. There's also some food waste, which I'm not gonna worry about. It's all the other stuff. It's like you can tell, food waste, not food waste. Hmm. Someone left a freaking diaper. All right, that was my second walk around. Dang it, there's something over here. Oh, there's something down here too. When you think you're done, you find something. A Capri Sun. Leaving bad examples for the kids. Whoever was camped here. All right, I'm gonna chill. I have everything cleaned up for the most part. Yeah, everything's cleaned up, put away. Well, not put away, but cleaned up. So I'm gonna chill and see where the day takes me. I'll probably just be relaxing and then eventually I'm gonna have to pack up and go. All right, so I've just been chilling. I did have a question for you guys though. Um, so I have this Mr. Buddy heater. I tried turning it on this morning and it wouldn't light. The pilot, like the flame here, it would come, but the pilot light wouldn't stay on. If anyone has any suggestions or any ideas why that's happening, it would be greatly appreciated. I am probably gonna look it up when I get home. It's just, I know I'm in no rush to look it up because it's summertime. I honestly, I had no real reason to turn it on this morning other than just being lazy and wanting that little extra heat. Um, but anyways, I have got everything outside of my tent. I am going to kick it into high gear now, pack it up and get out of here. Uh, 
All right, I got everything packed up and put away. With a little reworking around, I was able to get those foam stuff in my truck. Fire is out. Just gotta put this in the truck. There we go. All right, make sure I didn't forget anything. No, everything's packed up, cool. You know, can I tell you guys? This is one of my favorite fire rings that I ever made. Turned out so well. I know it'll get destroyed and probably put with that bigger one when another group comes, but whatever, still had fun. Anyways, I just wanna say I appreciate you guys. Remember, it's only impossible until it no longer is, and hopefully I'll see you next time. All right, take care, guys.